Yes, uh, colleague. Uh, Mr. Camillo, three past. Why are you here? Um, I came here uh, to engage uh, the leadership here, uh, the command here, uh, because I think uh, this is getting out of hand to have opposition leaders uh, you know, arrested at every juncture when uh, they criticize you know, the government of UPND for the ills they continue occasioning against the people of Tanzania. I was just released yesterday after I officially brought to the Minister of Health and then had a press briefing demanding for answers over the issue of uh, minimum and maize that is a poison with the aflatoxin. And in the wisdom of the police, I needed not to criticize the UPN. The Minister of Health confirmed and even listed those they say that that particular point that investigated to have the minimum in stock that have also released in the market that has aflatoxins. If you go to uh, the health experts, they will tell you that there is even a study that has been conducted on the effects of aflatoxins and how it affects human beings. The cancers that are, you know, uh, prevalent and prominent if you go at the cancer hospital to treat. I just came to challenge and fraud uh, department and also attempted to see the IG so that they can give me an office space either in the IG's office or any of the offices so that we shift our activities from the secretariat to the police because it looks like that's what the police want for us to be having press briefings at the police. So I came to demand for that. The IG has not seen me today but uh, I will come back tomorrow at 10 hours again to demand that we are given space for us to be having press briefings. Because it looks like the police service has now turned into a political party or an extension of UPND as a political party. We have police officers who are playing politics. Instead of spokespersons of UPND government, spokespersons in the presidency or otherwise to respond to us, it's the police that are responding through arrests, trying to gag us and stop us from speaking. And I promise in Zaka and Deja, wherever he is, that we will not stop talking. We will criticize him every day for as long as he continues to occasion pain on the Zambia When you look at the high cost of you know, commodities, people can't afford minimum, people can't afford timo, people can't afford basic things, including the price of fuel. The price of everything, and they want us to keep quiet, that will not do. We are also speaking even on behalf of the police officers. They are also eating the same minimum, which has uh, from toxins, and that will not permit. So if the, you, the police want to play politics, we'll come and play it here. Thank you very much. Would you, would you respond to Mr. Mkambombo, who in the newspapers is saying for the mouth of the Wow. Uh, first of all, these are minions of UPND who were very loud when they were in opposition. In the house. Yeah. Uh, so the, the UPND were very loud in opposition. And that is what led them to form government. There is only one way to politics. It is to engage in public discourse. What the UPND are doing is wanting to prescribe to us how we should criticize them, how we should provide checks and balances. They want to give us a template. The police want to be editing our English. You use the word terror. If, in my opinion, feeding people with poison minimum is an, an act of terror against the citizens, it's an act of genocide of the citizen. How is it that they would want to stop me from thinking and having an opinion? That is what has uh, caused me to come here. And we'll continue. If the police get involved in politics, we'll come and play politics from the police. Thank you very much.